Physically and mentally, I, I feel ready and prepared. Uh, physically, my body's prepared this time. Uh, it's rejuvenated, it feels comfortable, it feels relaxed from all the fights and everything. It feels calm. Mentally, I'm doing good because my mind is right. I don't have to worry about the weight no more like I was before in the past. I've been doing it right and uh, I'm ready to fight now. How important is this considering your entire career? Well, this fight is, is, is raised a lot because uh, when I fought Pacquiao, that, it raided my fight a lot, but going to that fight, it wasn't Brandon Real. It was another guy on top of the world, another guy that I think his shit didn't stink. But this fight, it means a lot, way more, I think, because this can boost up my career, or it can probably keep it the same, or maybe even drop it down. So I'm taking every advantage of this fight and everything I have to do to, to win this fight so I can boost up my career. And make and keep my name as a threat in the division. So that's what it means a lot to me. So what are the things that you're still learning at this stage of your career? You know what? I'm learning more about the discipline. That's that thing I learned something new. The discipline part, uh, training, everything, and then more of a head movement. Uh, start to avoid a lot of punches. Don't avoid getting hit too much. Move around a lot. Not move around a lot, but move your head more. Use a lot of jab. But the mainly one is the uh, discipline. The discipline for this fight, uh, the weight loss, uh, everything, the physical, all that stuff, that's what I'm learning, uh, mainly learning more about this fight. How important is it or was it for you to get back with Robert Garcia? You know, it's been very important. Not only that, but it was really important because uh, not only Robert Garcia, I'm back with Don Leary. Mm -hmm. uh, these two guys uh, made me a world champion. Mm -hmm. So I'm back with them again. It means a lot to me. Uh, Especially with Robert, you know, me and Robert's like brothers and like, you know, a brother from another mother and I love Robert to death. Same with Donald too. So it means so much to get these two back in my career at this point. Uh, so when you, make, when you feel happy training, it makes it go easier and it's faster that way and you, and you want it more because they want it as well as you want it. So it makes it more happy. Especially to have Donald Leary and uh, like I said, Robert Garcia, the brothers. So who's going to be in your corner on, uh, on fight night? On fight night, Robert's going to be in the in the corner, but Donald's gonna be also in the corner too. They're both gonna be in my corner, but Robert and Donald's too gonna be there. But Robert's gonna be inside the ring because uh, uh, Donald feels like he has more experience inside the ring, so that's why he gave him the opportunity to be in more in the ring, which is understandable. But as long as Donald's in the ring with me, right there in the corner, I'm okay with it because I don't see Robert more than Donald, I don't see Donald more than Robert. I see them equal. And, and Donald's been with me like from day one too. Like he's in the gym with me, Monday, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Wednesdays and Friday we go to Riverside, we do sparring over there. But I'm in the gym with Rod and with Donald, and he's practicing everything that we need to practice on. He's doing the mid with me, he's doing everything, keeping an eye on me, which is really good. Okay, so knowing that you're gonna have both of them with you on fight night, does that give you more confidence knowing that they're there with you during the fight, or do you even think about that once the bell rings? It gives me confidence that they're right there with me, so I know that. But when that bell ring, they're not in the ring with me, it's just me. So when that bell ring, I'm confident because, and I feel comfortable because I've done all the hard work in the gym. So when I go in the ring, I know I'm ready, and I feel ready. I'm ready to fight, because I've done everything I had to do to do that, to, to get to that fight. So, but what makes it more of an exciting, it makes it more plus, A plus, is that I have Donald and, uh, and Robert right there in the corner. I know when I get done with the, when the bell rings, I go back to the corner and I see Donald and Robert, I feel, I feel happy, so it's okay. all good. Okay, tell me, talk, talk to me a little bit about Danny Garcia. What do you think of him? Uh, well, you know, Danny Garcia, he's a, he's a tough fighter. He got power, he got, a, he got a nasty left hook we got to watch out for. And, you know, I know he's going to mean a lot. You know, I know he's going to come to win. He's going to do everything he got to do to win. So, but I know it's going to be a tough fight, and uh, I'm ready for the best Danny Garcia to get to come out there because I know he wants the title back. So, I'm ready for the best Danny Garcia, and we got to, I got to follow the game plan that Donald and uh, Robert make, and we got to do. So, we gotta, that's what we got to do. Okay, finally, the message for uh, for your fans who want to see you as a world champion. Everybody around the world that has been following me for me, and thank you guys for the support. Love you guys, and uh, you know, Bam Bam's back, and he's going to be back to the top, and I'm ready to go. Este segmento de Contragolpe fue traído por Orchatería Río Luna. Orchatería Río Luna, en la ciudad de Paramount.